Alright, well, there's some news in the subject of euthanasia, right to die, uh, assisted suicide, um, whatever you want to call it. Um, anyway, but we'll get to that in a minute. Uh, the Morbid Atheist did post a video response to the last video, and it's pretty good. I mean, he does this style with playing the video games and talking, which is pretty good. Um, except it was kind of a lame game he was playing, so... Uh, but anyway, it was, it was uh, what he said was good. The content was good, and uh, so it's a video worth watching, I think, if you give a damn about the subject. Um, another thing I guess I'd mention is that the, the point of this channel is sort of to organize people, so some of this stuff's going to just be redundant. I mean, I'll do videos, and the intent is that maybe some new person will see it, and they'll say, ah, yeah, that's a good subject. We ought to do something about that. And so the idea is... Uh, you know, to organize people, so um, I, I, I'm not asking you to subscribe because, you know, whatever. Just subscribe to say, yes, I support this subject, this this point of view on the subject. Um, because the only way anything's going to change is there has to be enough people uh, that give a shit to change things. And uh, it doesn't look like we're anywhere close to where we need to be. Um, so anyway, in the news, there's this organization called Final Exit Network, and apparently they were um, centered in Georgia, and uh, the FBI, and working through these, all the little state bureaus in nine states, um, decide to arrest uh, some people and harass these people for helping other people to die. I think they've helped a total of 62 people or something. Whoop-de-doo. <laughs> um, all people that have a story. And uh, it's uh, it's just so lame. Uh, you know, because the, the, the argument, oh, yeah, I do, you know, we, we switch. We can't allow people to make a determination for themselves when they've had enough of something. And even though this guy had throat cancer, and even though he had surgery, words that should scare the shit out of you, cancer and surgeries um, no it's not good enough because he wasn't terminally ill <laughs> uh, you know it's just it's, it's disgusting I mean the fact that we even have to talk about this or do something about this or that it takes any effort at all after the whole Kevorkian thing um, you know the, the, to, to realize that people just don't give a shit turns my stomach in such horrible directions I hate the fucking human race. Yeah, I just, I, you know, I curse you all to die. <laughs> Harris, how's that? Oh, that's right, you've already been cursed to die. Well, then I hope you get exactly what you deserve, which is no empathy. Um, let nature um, and humanity throw its worst at you. Every steel rod they can shove up your ass, every little test they can do on you, everything they can shove down your throat or into your ear or whatever the fuck they can do to you, you deserve it. You deserve to... You deserve every fucking horror uh, nature and humanity can impose on you. Um, human beings suck. I mean, if you can't have empathy for people in pain, um, I don't know what else, what can I say? Yeah, I just, I hate your fucking guts. You make me sick. You make me want to puke. Um, I hate the human race. I hate it with a, a, an intense passion. Um, yeah, if the button to blow up this motherfucking planet was in front of me, I would smash it to hell. Alright, because we don't deserve to be here. We have no... Our intelligence is a waste. All it is is a scheming tool so we can rip somebody else off, rip their skin off and eat it. Um, we, 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 we suck. Um, and the fact that we can't... The, the fact that there's not enough intelligent human creatures on this planet, out of seven billion of them, uh, you know, to be able to see to it that uh, people in pain uh, receive empathy. Uh, yeah, there's just nothing. There's, what, what, what can be said to this? What, what words can I utter out of my mouth? Um, it's, it's unacceptable to me, personally. Okay? You don't meet my standards, human beings. You're worse than animals. You deserve... Like I said, you have the knowledge and the wisdom to know better, and you don't do better. And there's, there's nothing. There's no excuse for that. I mean, so yeah, I, I, I wish every, every serial killer out there, serial, I don't know why I can't say that word, um, every plague, every blight, every, every volcano, every, every disaster that can fall on you, unfortunately, you've deserved, you deserve every bit of it. Um, 
because when you can make no effort at all, when you can do absolutely nothing at all uh, to prevent horror, you'll do nothing. I mean, when it, when it takes no, no, you don't even have to put a dime in the slot. You don't have to sacrifice a motherfucking thing to have respect for somebody else's right to die. I mean, if you don't want the right, if you're afraid that you're going to go crazy and say, I want to die when you really don't want to, you could just sign a waiver saying, I don't want the right to die. We can print it right on your driver's license. Do not give this person any autonomy. Do not respect his wishes, okay? Because he must be insane because he's saying things that are inconsistent with what he said before. You want that written on your driver's license? Fine. You want to give away your freedoms and your rights? Fine. There's nothing wrong with a society allowing you to say, don't let me be free. Don't let me make decisions for myself. Um, we can do that for you. But don't you take it away from other people. Don't you insult them and be patronize them and say, I know better what your cancer is. I know better what your throat surgeries mean. I know better what the quality of your life is. I know better that you should want to live. I mean, it's disgusting. It is so disgusting. I mean, if I had a gun, I would, you know, boom, 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 I'd shoot you all, fuckers. I mean, you're all fucking out of your mind. It is sadistic. It is worse than murder. It is worse than murder to impose life on something that is suffering. That is worse than murder. No doubt about it. No fucking doubt about it. And that's what you are. You're worse than murderers. You, you, you are, you are sadistic, evil bastards. <laughs> um... So yeah, that's what, what else can I say? And I know most of the people probably listening to this are not the sadistic evil bastards. They're just the people saying, oh, I know, it's fucked up. But like I said, you got to do something about it. You could at least comment on a video. You could at least post a video response. You could hit the subscribe button. You could just lose little tiny motherfucking things to say, yes, we've got to do something about this. We've got to organize and we've got to demand rights for people in pain. Um, it's just, it's, it's insane. It's, it is just that. It's just insane uh, to, to not accept that this life thing is not free. It, and it's not a gift from God. We're not offending a God by saying, no, this is enough pain. This individual's in a circumstance I understand. Yeah, there's no point in living in that circumstance. Uh, you know, what is this? This is just... So anyway, I don't know if I even got to the news story, but the point is they arrested these four people. Um, you know, for you know, providing the the charming medical technology of uh, you know a plastic bag and uh, helium gas, and they don't even provide it. They just tell the person where to buy it. Um, I mean, it's just this is horrible uh, that we can't do better than this as a society. If this is like I said, if this is what we are. Um, we deserve our wars. We deserve the horror. We des we all of it. We, we there isn't even a punishment we can impose on us that is suitable to what we deserve. If we can't do better in this case, I mean, if th if this is just it's just too insane for me to even I can't put it in my brain and say how does this make any sense at all? Who are these people walking on the streets? Who are these crazy fuckers? Uh, that could look somebody in the face who doesn't even have a face anymore uh, and say, no, you should suffer some more uh, because I think so. <laughs> I mean, uh, well, whatever. So, no need to say anything else. <laughs> Just really depressing, really discouraging, really alienating, really... Just makes you want to turn the key off, you know. I've seen enough, <laughs> you know, it's one of those kind of things, I've seen enough, <laughs> so, till next time, if there is a next time, whatever, <laughs> <Ugh>. <laughs>